hello everyone welcome back to my channel we're gonna do another reading vlog you guys uh the last reading vlog i did was amari and the night brothers which i'm actually currently trying to upload at this very moment and i am having a lot of trouble every time i try to export it it fails and so I'm not sure what's happening and I'm even trying to like export it to an external hard drive so that maybe I have space um, I don't know what's going on anyway welcome to a new vlog I have been trying to read these violent delights by Chloe Gong for literally a week and it's not that it's not good and I'm I'm only on page 55 and it's not that I'm not interested in it I don't know I haven't been motivated to read I don't know if it's just this book in general or what I just like can't sit down and read and so far this book is actually really good it's very interesting I like where it's going but I just I don't know I think it's just me so I'm gonna vlog in order to like get myself to just sit and read so I'm gonna go read a little bit after lunch um, and see how far I can get today but you're gonna come along for the ride with me. It is currently Wednesday. Wednesdays are my day off. This is actually my last day off for Wednesdays because I start classes on Monday, the 23rd. Oh, that's scary. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm scared. I don't have much more to say. So I'm gonna read a little bit. And then if I get through, like if I can get to page 100 or so and just like kind of get into this book, I will let you know how it goes and how I'm feeling, but for now, I'm going to say ta-ta. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Hi all, I just wanted to check in tonight. I haven't really read much tonight, um, so I'm going to read my Bible first and then read a little bit more tonight. I'm on page, I'm on page 91, so I'm almost at 100 pages, which is what I wanted to get to today, so that's good. I didn't read much today. I haven't really felt well. I've had a really bad headache. Um, Eddie and I took a two hour nap together this afternoon, which was really nice. <laughs> um, but I still just woke up feeling awful from it. Like it just almost made my head worse than making it better. It's getting good. It's getting, it's starting to be interesting. I think it's just taking a while to get into like learning about the two gangs and kind of trying to figure out what this monster is and Trying to get a little bit of the past of R Roma and Juliet's like relationship and why it's so strained. And I mean, they're the heirs of rival gang leaders. So it's just, it's interesting. So I just need to keep reading it. But um, it's 8.30 right now. I'm going to read my Bible and then spend the rest of the night reading this book. And probably go to bed again early because I still don't feel great. But I just wanted to check in, say hey, say if almost hit my goal of what I wanted to get to today so I'm happy about that hi guys today I'm gonna take you along with like my first day of in-person classes and being on campus I've never been on this campus before um, so it's gonna be interesting it's a lot bigger than what I'm used to and I'm a little nervous for that to be honest my first class is at 9 30 it's currently 9 a.m. right now and I just parked it is raining. I do have an umbrella, thank goodness. And my class is in the library. It is information and inquiry. So I think that's gonna be hopefully pretty interesting. We'll see. But I'm gonna be here all day. I left my house at 8.30. Probably gonna be here until about 7.30 tonight. So gonna be a really long day. I'm early, so I'm just gonna sit in my car for a little bit. Maybe the rain will die down a little bit. Um, and then I will get out and start walking to the library. Hopefully I remember where it's at. Nate and I came on a, he gave me like a little campus tour last weekend. And we walked around campus and nobody was here. It was fantastic. And he showed me where the buildings were and everything. So yeah, I'm kind of excited, kind of nervous. I don't know. I don't like in-person stuff as much because I'm someone like, I am not good at asking questions. Like I can't think of questions as I'm sitting there listening to stuff like that. And like discussions don't come to me right away. And especially with graduate classes, like there's a lot of discussion and like, you got to think on your feet, but like, I'm so much better at just like kind of sitting and passively like 
and taking it all and hearing what other people are saying before I can even come up with anything. Like, that's just how I am and how I've always been. So I'm a little nervous to be, like, in person where I'm, like, there. And I don't think there's going to be a whole lot of people there. So, like, I'm probably going to have to talk a decent amount, which makes me kind of nervous. So we'll see. Tonight is the class that I have. Sorry about the rain. Tonight is the class where I had to read Omari and the Night Brothers. So I'm really excited about that. And I had to read some interesting articles for this class this morning. So we'll see how today goes. But I plan on taking you along with me. Hi guys, it's the next day. It's Tuesday. I forgot to update you guys last night when I was coming home. I was kind of just in a hurry to get home and I just like made a new friend in class. So I didn't even think about recording and I really just wanted to get home. It's, it had been a long day. Um, I got out of my class at like seven. So it had been a very long day, almost a 12 hour day and I was pooped. Anyway, that class was really good. That was a class that I had to read Amari and the Night Brothers for. And I think it's gonna be a fantastic class. There's some really fun stuff that we're gonna be doing. Reading a lot of children's YA books, which right up my alley. We also have to do some like Instagram your reading assignments. So I'll be Instagramming um, more than normal. I'm terrible at Instagramming, but I'm hoping I can just use my um, books with Ange Instagram. I also have a personal Instagram, so I don't I don't want to make like a third Instagram because that would be a pain. Um, so yeah, it's yeah, it's been fun. Today's Tuesday. Um, I worked this morning. It's currently five o'clock in the afternoon. Um, it's currently storming outside, which is awesome. We need it so bad. I was in like a really bad drought, especially where I'm at. Um, the grass is just, it's crunchy. It's bad. So the rain is much needed. And now I'm just sitting here and doing some reading for my class that I have tomorrow night. And Eddie is, he got like a snuggle, snug, snug. I don't remember what Nate keeps calling it. Some type of like ruggy type thing. Like it's a bowl, it's like a snuggle bowl or something like that. And you put the food in it and like they have to sniff around for it, except now he's just tearing it apart, so I don't know. Anyway, speaking of these violent delights, I'm getting much further. I'm on page like 250 something, and it's getting good, but there hasn't been any romance yet. But I do know that there is a sequel coming out, so I'm hoping that it's just like mega slow burn and that it'll finally happen because I'm like, 65 70% of the way done and there, where's the romance I need it so anyway that's where I'm at but it's really good it's getting really interesting it's very political it's very um it's very Romeo and Juliet retelling it's funny because like the names are Roma and Juliet like it's just funny but it's really good and I'm enjoying it and I'm hoping to finish it this week actually guys I finished it and it's been, this, this vlog has been all over the place. Uh, I started last Wednesday, which was the 18th. It's currently Friday the 27th, but I have officially finished this book finally after 17 days. It took me 17 days to read this book. Anyway, this book got so much better once I got to like page 300 and something out of 439. The book itself is really good. It was just really slow paced for me and the romance, there's not a whole lot of romance. Like there is, but there's not. Um, it's definitely slow burn and it's almost like slow crash and burn kind of situation because it's Romeo and Juliet. And I just, I don't know, I'm the ending of this book was phenomenal, like the last 150 pages 
was probably the best part of the book. But because there's a sequel, I'm giving it some grace because it's building up and leading into the next book. However, it just took kind of a long time. And I don't know, it was, the beginning of this book was really, really gory. And I didn't love that. I don't love a whole lot of gore. But I was able to kind of look past that and keep reading. And it ended up being really great. I really, really enjoyed the side characters in this book. So there's three that were amazing. There's Marshall, Benedict, and Kathleen. And I really, really, really enjoyed them as much as I enjoyed the main characters. And there's some questions I have left. Um, I think that this book leaves you with some like open-ended questions, um, and, like stuff that hasn't been solved yet. And it also just, like you think the ending is resolved, but in reality it's not. And so it's just, it's really good. The ending itself just made me so mad and I just want the next book. It leaves you with some like really good cliffhangers and overall it was just, it was really good. I gave it four stars because of how slow it was for me up until the end. But I loved that this was like Romeo and Juliet meet a monster kind of thing and like are trying to overtake a monster. It was almost kind of like a, a mystery too because you're trying to solve this issue, this monster that is tearing apart this city by infecting people with insects. Uh, so it was like, it was just really interesting. And so for that, I enjoyed it. But yeah, I, I'm really excited for the next book, which I don't remember what it's called. I think the title has been released, but I don't actually know for sure. Anyway, so that's that book. I enjoyed it, four stars. Can't wait for the next one to come out. And currently, like I said, it's Friday. So I'm gonna end this vlog. It's been a while. This needs to go up tomorrow. Um, so I'm gonna sit down and edit this, but I'm excited. That was probably, that's, probably my second to last book. I'm going to try to finish this book before August is over, which is Not Happy Family by Sherry Lapina, which is my book of the month choice for this month. And I want to finish it because September I plan on going through the Zodiac Academy finally. Um, but I'm going to save that for September to go through all of them, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Uh, we'll see how that actually goes. So that is it for this video. This crazy wacky vlog where I barely hopped on and, and <laughs> checked in with you guys. I started my first day of classes. Um, it's just kind of been chaotic, but it's been, it's been fun. So we're going to finish out August with this book and yeah, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys have a fantastic week and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.